Hello everybody, I'm BookTube. It's Andrea here and I'm here today to give you another fabulous, I hope, unboxing. So this is my second subscription box that I've ever bought. This one is uh, called uh, Book and a Brew. So it does what it says on the tin. So basically there's a book in it and there's tea in it. What more could a girl want, I say? So yes, yeah, so again, this is another UK subscription box. This one is monthly and costs £12. I will put a link to their website down below in case you're interested. You never know, the book you book we get, you might really like. So as you can see, it's still sealed. So I haven't opened it. I only picked it up from the post office today. I'm gonna break the seal now with my scissors, hopefully. I'm not good with scissors. I don't think anybody on booktube is good with scissors by the sound of it. Everybody always gets worried they're gonna hurt themselves or break something. But oh, we're in now. Question is, book or brew first? Let's have a look. So it's, it's set up like like that. It's very pretty, very nice with some packaging. So oh, we got Welsh. This this is. Welsh, Murrow's Welsh Tea Birds, Lemon and Ginger, 15 Luxury Pyramid Bags. Ah, oh, it smells lovely. So that is the tea for this month. So 15, that's pretty good. That's 15 cups of tea. I like that. Let's pop that one just up there now. Let's see what book we've got. Oh, okay, here, oh, it's a, oh, looks nice. Right, okay, we have in here, the books, the information sheet, what's this, a little, a card, I'm assuming it's advertising another book which is Dark Star by Oliver Langmead, sounds interesting, okay I've got that here, and the book, it is, and it's, oh, it's even wrapped up in paper. Look at that. They've even wrapped it nicely in paper with, oh, look at the book and a brew sticker. So it's hardback. So we're going to have a look, see what it is. Get in there, pop it now. Ah! Oh. And it is Jill Hornby All Together Now. Apparently she wrote the best selling book, Hive. There's the cover. It's actually a really nice cover. I loved it when they got the raised letter in. So there's the cover. It's a yellow end paper. It's just a normal book. Although the writing on the side's not quite nice there. There we go. So yellow end papers. We like yellow in this house. So that yellow end papers there. And it says. The small town of Bridgeford is in crisis. The high street is half empty, businesses are closing, and the idea of civic pride feels old fashioned to the commuters rushing home from work. Somehow it seems to have lost its heart. There's one thing that might just bring the town together, music. The Bridgeford Community Choir has a chance of ringing, winning the county championship. But first, the small band of singers must find a lot of new members and a whole new sound. Enter Tracy, one of life's soloists and hide in a secret past Bennett, a church choir refugee, baffled by the modern world. And Jazzy, who sees her voice as a passport straight out of town to a future of fame and fortune. Can they really fit in with the dependable old regulars like Annie? Can they learn to work together, save their singing group, and maybe even their community? All Together Now is a funny, sharply observed and moving novel about the joys of singing, about living in harmony, about falling in love and about the importance of finding your own true voice. Oh, that really sounds good. This has a recommended retail price of fourteen ninety nine. And... Let's have a look. Yeah, it was first published in 2015, but do you know what? I mean, for £12... You get the book and the tea in the box, nicely wrapped with a little book and a brew label on it. I mean, what more could you want? Beautifully packaged. We really like this. I'm going to try this tea in this book next week because I've got a day's annual leave and I plan to read lots. So that was in my unboxing this time. Um, yeah, I've subscribed to this, so I will be getting one of these every month. Now, I just want to say that I have paid for this myself. 
they have not paid me or sent me anything free to review this it is it is I paid for this I'm really looking forward to it. it looks like an interesting story I've not read anything of Jill Hornby so I'll let you know what I think about it when I've finished and obviously next month I'll show you the next box that a book and a brew send me so I'm really really excited about that I just love these unboxing and I've got some more books coming and I, I got another book in the mail today which is really exciting so anyway that's all for me now I, I mean if you want to if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe ask me any questions you want to leave a comment in the comment section below I will happily reply to all comments just you know let me know what you're reading this weekend this weekend I'm reading Jodie Taylor's uh, A Second Chance which is the third one in the Chronicles of St Mary's and I plan on getting to grips with my Thomas Hardy biography so what are you reading let me know and I will see you soon happy reading bye